Okay. This is a short one, very quick, but it started with a previous video, so I'm going to finish it up in this kind of sequel, part two. There might be a part three and part four, but that hasn't happened yet. So, you hear about the pheromones at a funeral one? Well, <laughs> I have another pheromone thing that happened. It was a complete accident. I didn't even anticipate this. And yes, those roses there are for Matthew from me, because I'm a nice guy. And there's a dozen. They're, they're, they're starting to wilt. They need some TLC, but they're there. Anyway. We had that real big cold snap here, you know, those like minus temperatures and every, you know, all this crap going on. Well, yeah, it was cold here. It was bitter. I will admit my car was like, whoa, trying to turn over. So, yay. Well, that was like two days of that. And I, well, because I sing and whatnot, I got to protect my little larynx here. Come over, spoke, got to protect it. So I have this scarf here. Eddie Bauer. Woohoo! Wrapped around me. Now I'm going to work, you know. And that one morning, I put on the pheromones, because I was bored, apparently. So I put them on, wrap the scarf around me, and I go to work. I could not figure out why, for eight hours, I was seriously charged up. I'm like, getting all hot and bothered, you know, and I'm like, what is wrong with me? Why am I so stirred up? Ah, oh, like, I was just getting down the bad self. I needed to, like, you know, do something catch my drift, and I'm like, really? Uh, it was like four times that day. It's like, <laughs> turns out, that night I'm laying in bed going, I don't feel like it anymore. I, maybe I got out of my system. Okay, whatever. I just had one, like a spike or something that day. No, I had pheromones on my neck. I had this thing wrapped around my face. Guess who's breathing in the pheromones? Yeah. So anyway, that was that. So now I gotta like remember to, when you wear a scarf, hint to you people, a little bit of a tip of advice here. Don't wear a scarf if you have pheromones on. You turn yourself on so bad it's ridiculous. Like I was constantly, if that makes any sense to those of you that are picking up what I'm putting down here. Cool? Alright. Anyway, that's that short one. Very quick. I do have more updates coming. In fact, my background here is going to change very soon. So I'll explain that when it happens. But until then, I gotta give some shout outs. And I don't have a note, so I'm going by memory here. A certain person in Greencastle, that goes out to you. There's, uh, who else do I have? There's like four or five people that, you know, have been telling me. Wait, I have my phone. Yeah, my trusty phone. And by the way, I bought new batteries. And it still doesn't work the way I want it to. So, but, um, let me see here. Oh, yeah, I bet you guys didn't know this. Look who's on my background. Alright, you know who that is. He walks back and forth occasionally blowing his nose. Anyway, let me see here. I have... Let me think here. I've got a few of them i got to give way to. Let me see here who gets them. Because I promise people, and I don't want to go back on what I'm promising people, you know. My often... My... my What is that called? My uh, integrity? Is that what you call it? Dom! Yahoo! That one's for you. I have another one. And Sarah! Woo! Okay, there's that. I think there's another one. I'm sure there is. I bet you any money. I'm going to sit here and go through all of these and have to find the one I'm supposed to give out to. I think that was everybody for now, I think. I could be very wrong about that. So, but in the meantime, I just wanted to uh, let you guys know about my little pheromone incident. <sighs> it's just weird, the randomness of how things go, but yay. It was intense in a way. But yeah, I couldn't figure out why it kept hitting me. But it did. So, anyway, I'm gonna go now, because I got stuff to do today. Because sun's out! Well, it's sort of partly cloudy over here. Kinda. I mean, it snowed. Go figure! It's like January. Oh yes, I'm gonna go see Punk's Tony Phil. That's something else I want to do. Take the day and do that. That's kind of my little thing I want to do for myself here in like a week and a half. Um, I might have a video. We'll see. But I will say, I went up here one time, and they must have had like two inches of snow, and it had sleeted or iced or something, or freezing rain, or whatever you want to call it. It packed it down, and it was like slicker and snot in a doorknob up there. But I tell you, there was 33,000 people that year, I found out. But, you know, I didn't see one person fall. They must be like a predominant, like, some sure-footed Germans, because I didn't see anyone falling. And, it, and I will admit, it was slicker. It was up there. But anyway, so, anyway, on that note, I'm going to go. You guys be good. Keep the requests coming. You can text me all you want. Whatever you got to do. So in the meantime, be good. If you can't wait, have be good. If you can't be good, be good at it. If you can't be good at it, have fun trying. And yes, I'm gonna improve it. And I have a surprise. 
for you guys on like the next video. Wait, you gotta watch it. It's like a new thing I'm doing. But I can't tell you, because it's a surprise. But just watch. Cool. Alright, see you guys later. Keep rocking. See ya. Toodles.